Good day, fellas. I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill. And today, fellas, we are playing with a T34 slash one. One of, I would say, shitter tier seven medium tanks. And recently I got up to 100% of the mark of excellence on this thing. And oh boy, oh boy, the gaming experience was quite um, interesting with this tank. There was some battles when when this vehicle was behaving properly, when we was hitting majority of our shots and everything. But in some battles, ooh, it was not the most enjoyable gaming experience and I was pretty much missing everything, which was very, very sad. And this battle is the best battle which I had with this uh, vehicle and I think that was the most interesting and the most intense game. So that's why I picked this one. Um, there was many games where I had better score but it's not about the score. It is about what we are doing and how we are playing. So how we are starting this battle? We are having a typical start right there. We are going piri piri into the middle bush where scouts is usually playing and we will try to um, punish enemies for their mistakes. Aiming, gaming, 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 gaming and 250 in the side of the Patriot. Very, very good. That's very nice. Can we get another one? I'm trying and I'm going for a blind shot. Um, more likely that shot was the hit. So for some people who is not aware of what this vehicle is, it is a tier 7 Chinese T-34-1 or however you are calling this vehicle. And everything would be fine about this tank but looks like the gun is made in China. What that basically means, you will miss majority of your shots yourself. By the way, we can see that we hit him and yes we did. We hit him before fellas, so that Patriot, uh, um, we have one blind shot over there, which is great, which is fine. So, look, all I want to do right there, I want to currently sit in the middle and wait until the enemies will make a mistake like this IS-3 did, right? And now look, this is going to be interesting stuff. You see the light tank which is going for us? I am thinking I can outplay him. I can deal with this guy without bigger problems whatsoever. We have the shot, we are going for another one into the T-71, but T-71 is mad. And uh, for, some, uh, for every single of you, I believe you know this vehicle is the... Um, the light tank with, uh, with a magazine, right? So, oh boy, oh boy. He took a big chunk of the hit points right there. I'm down to 300 hit points, the score is 2 to 4, everything is looking quite badly I would say, and uh, this battle is pretty much just starting, right? Let's see what we can do of all this. Um, as you can see, majority of our forces is playing in the magical forest, Ooh, remember Magical Forest days in, in, uh, in this map where uh, there was pretty much no gaps and all map was the flat line with, uh, with like three times more trees than it is now. It used to be a good days. Anyways, so far 1000 damage dealt, 1000 uh, assisting damage uh, and we are loading APCRs because of the Mr. IS-3, right? So we are waiting until he is going to make something stupid and can we penetrate his side? Beautiful penetration into the side, who could ever thought? Um, by the way, in order to make this tank good, in my opinion, right? Um, the tank needs to have just tiny touch better gun handling. With a, be uh, with a bit better gun handling, we can ignore the fact this tank is uh, getting lit on fire. We can ignore the fact uh, it doesn't have good gun depression um, and so on so on. But the gun handling could be just a bit better. But it is Chinese tank which is kind of understandable and uh, the gun handling is not looking that great, right? So far kind of boring start, but oh boy, oh boy, everything is going to change right there. So now we need to figure out how the bloody F we want to win this battle. Our team have safe defense parameter, enemy team have uh, kind of safe defense parameter, but Tiger is going in front and he is making mistake. I tried to pre-aim um, on this guy, but obviously he died before... Um, I managed to punish him, which is completely fine. Oh, APCR, Jack, Jack Tiger side, pissed into the side, 250, and he did not manage to spot us. Great, excellent. 
Uh, so we are going to come back into the same bush and we are waiting until the Jack Tiger or Oni is going to make the same mistake. Now look, there is a, some kind of, we have a good angle to penetrate this guy. We aim it for his boob and snipe penetration. Obviously he spotted us, but it doesn't matter. We are feeling definitely Gucci. Now the Su-101 um, is uh, kind of charging for us, but I don't really care about that guy and there is a reason. Um, I am more worried if enemies are going to make a pressure for us like this, okay, because it would be a disaster. This Su, he can't do anything and probably they have a very, very fun fight. Did you notice that there is three artists in this game? Oh, yes, fellas. When you are getting spotted, you need to move, otherwise you are going to get clicked and you will forget your name. So once again, we don't want to take any silly risks whatsoever. Meanwhile, the Jack Tiger is going in front, we managed to hit him, he spotted us, I am running for my life. Meanwhile, the Model 1 is saying and he is making a pressure, but luckily our Su-130 punished him in in front in, you know, of his face, right? Beautiful. Uh, so Model 1 is down to one shotable. Now I'm thinking, oh boy, oh boy, do I want to go for this Su or I don't want to go for this Su? Do I want to go for this Su or I don't want to? Mm, side, side side trying to aim for a lower plate and obviously that was my bad the shot from my side was not glorious so yeah unfortunately i did not punish at him it is okay uh, it is okay not a big deal so far 2.3 thousand damage because we have one blind shot 1.6 thousand assisting damage which is great and look at this model one we spotted model one we yeah he got killed from the zoo the zoo is a great sniper schnitzel and so far he did everything properly by the way have you ever heard saying stop camping um bitch yep as you can see, that was the case and I took one for the team. It is okay, not a big deal. So, we have uh, 68 hit points. One for a perfect uh, hit point score idea, but it is okay. Now look, the situation. Couple of uh, the tank destroyers. They are in platoon. And uh, three artists. How to approach the enemies without getting killed? This is the question which is in my head and I have no bloody clue how. Because you see our Vaza which is going in front, he's going to get murdered because some of the Vaza is probably having the safe defense parameter. So I thought, mm -hmm. both of those guys is playing in platoon. I mean, yes, as you can see, Vaza killed Vaza unexpected. One of the Vaza is in the base and he's defending the base, so I cannot make a pressure for him. And another Vaza is over there. Holy bananas. So now what we know, we know one Vaza is here, another Vaza is here. They have Artas and uh, um, the things is not looking very good. What I need to do, I need to repush them somehow. Because otherwise it's going to be Armageddon. It's going to be extremely bad story. Right? So what we are doing, we are trying to make a bit of pressure like this. Right? Um, the most important thing for us to outspot this uh, Vaza. We have two clickers. So those two clickers can definitely punish this Vaza for his mistake. Right? And that's what we want to see. Right there, fellas. I'm going piri piri into the bush over there. Why so? Because, uh, once again, we can outspot him and, and hopefully our clickers is going to punish him for his mistake, right? That's what we need. Obviously, our artist did not react in time, which is kind of sad. And we are waiting until this Vaza is going to peak once again, because this is what I can do. Meanwhile, our Su, um, the guy which played extremely well till now, uh, he's sitting over there. What we could do together, together we could go on this Vaza and we could kill him. But you know, I mean, I completely understand what he is doing right there. He's trying to play this safe because there is still six minutes left, which is completely understandable. So... Once again, be patient. Fellas, sometimes patience, it is the key and it is not a joke. Sometimes patience is the key. So, once again, sitting in the bush, looking what is happening, how many hit points Su has. Su has full hit points, holy bananas. I'm thinking it would be so damn good to go together and push this guy right there, but... Um, 
it is how it is and not much what we can change right there and enemy uh, was is relocating right there meanwhile one of our artists blind shot it rib headset users i apologize fellas i am semi ill i am semi sick and uh, I Kyler's will fix everything right there. It will make uh, it as um, as silent as possible, so you can make some fun of me in the comment section down below. Okay, I am feeling semi sick and my uh, throat is kind of killing me, but shh, it's not about that. Anyways, the zoo is making pressure in front right there we manage it to punish him once which is extremely good and now i am kind of afraid if this uh sue is going to make a hardcore pressure on me because that would be pretty much the worst thing ever so i am already starting to think about relocating to be honest but there is other uh, alternative option and this alternative option is to take this bush right so from this bush pay attention to this view circle um we can spot the bushwankers over there if they will shoot or if they will move we can see if this was a making a pressure idea or something and look at this enemy was the other enemy was is um is destroying our art so he is sitting somewhere around this area by the way one thing which i need to mention right there the main reason why i'm not pushing on this was a uh over there is three artists if those three artists is praying at over there and i can bet those guys is praying at over there then it's not going to be gucci then i am going to get clicked and look at my hit points i cannot take any risks whatsoever but what i decided to do i decided to go like this and maybe i can hunt the other was i have no bloody clue how many hit points he has and maybe we can get a lot of use right so we are pushing in front and was is getting spotted was i have full hit points holy mother of bananas this is not looking good but i have a plan already pay attention i'm loading the high explosive ammunition in order to track this was i'm dodging the artists armageddon is over there fellas our clicker manager to hit was for 40 something it doesn't matter i am running was is right there i'm aiming for a track and we manage to track him since we tracked him he changed the direction and he and he missed his shot beautiful 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 i can't remember the last time when i ran so fast fellas and i'm running i'm saying oh mother trucker not today and right here fellas i cannot go and flank him the main reason of all this is clickers so for me it is the plan b leave this vaza we trolled him quite a bit everything is fine that was just simply gucci i need to f off from here it's understandable right and i am thinking maybe i can be that ninja turtle which is going in front and <sighs> killing artists that would be great don't you think so so we loaded standard ap ammunition and i am thinking how to approach the clickers right there as you can see probably that was a is trying to hunt me down but i don't really mind um i am trying not to break stuff right there not even small walls because nowadays there is some people which is using those mods which is showing uh, this stuff which is breaking on the max map i'm not joking and look at our approach we are going like this through the bushes we are trying to um see maybe some clickers is over there and oh boy oh boy we spotted clicker clicker is going in front himself aggressively and you know what okay look this guy played extremely well this battle but this is a critical mistake which this person did okay uh 
first of all, he's not using the double bushes right there. He high rolled this was a, but he's going to die because of the three artists and stuff, right? All this guy needed to do, he needed to make some kind of pressure. Vaza is reloading faster than he does. Vaza had high explosives and the other Vaza is eliminating him from the game. The thing is, what this guy needed to do, this guy needed to start making pressure. When he saw the Vaza was down to one shotable for him, he needed to go aggressively like this because he had some hit points he could do. He could eliminate this Vaza from the game. Um... Either way, he supported me well during this battle, don't get me wrong, this comrade, he did, if I'm not mistaken, 5000 damage, which is huge number, okay? Uh, when we was playing over there, he shot everything, he eliminated that so he hit some other shots, and this guy played well, but that was... Um, the biggest mistake which the Su did, he did not made aggression when he needed to. Uh, it happens, it happens for everyone, I misplayed billion of the times and that was misplayed by that guy's side, but it is how it is, no complaints, no regrets. I think this battle was the most intense of out of games which I had with a T-34 uh, slash 1, probably majority of you would agree this tank is not very good as a tier 7 vehicle, but I had some fun marking it and uh, um, I had love and hate relationship with this vehicle. Um, I had shit on a fun while playing with it, and in the same time I had a pain. What do you mean, skill? Well, the pain was in the situations when I was aiming my shots fully and I was missing the enemy tanks by the inch or by the two, or alternatively when the gun handling simply said, you know, just, just no, not today, my friend. So it was love and hate relationship. Sometimes it was working well, sometimes it was not working too well. Anyways, fellas, I hope you enjoyed your daily dose of skill. I'm sorry for my uh, throat. It's not looking that good. I don't know. Can you see the difference? And can you hear the difference in my voice or not? Either way, thank you so much for watching. It was for me a pleasure to look into this uh game once again and to check out what kind of score we did and in the same time uh, to get clicked once again thank you so much for watching see you next time my friends uh, peace